Hey everyone, Astronibble here. And today I need to discuss a video made a couple days ago uh, regarding the GXP anime series that has been announced recently. And the first thing is the some additional information about the series. And the second is something I said in the original video that I need to clarify. So regarding the additional information, people have asked me, well, okay, where is what what novels are these going to adapt? And from what I can understand, <clears throat> none. Tajishima Sensei normally does not like to recover old ground. And so this new GXP anime series is going to be set after the current GXP novels, whatever they're up to. I think maybe volume 16. Don't quote me. I don't remember. I'd have to go look. But whatever volume they're up to in Japan, it will be set well after that. The purpose of this series is to bridge the gap between the GXP novels and the Paradise War uh, novels. So that's it. <clears throat> so what does that mean? Well, they in the announcement, it also said something about between OBA4 and OBA5 is when the new GXP uh, anime series would be set, and that is correct. But that also means that for us Westerners, I'm afraid there's going to be a high entry bar because they're going to expect you to know characters going in just like they did for their OVA4, just like they did with OVA5 for Tenshi Mio. They're just going to expect you to know these things, and there's not going to be any hand-holding. At least I don't expect any. Now, it's possible this new anime production company may force Kajishima Sensei to do more. I kind of doubt it, though. Kajishima Sensei is notorious about not recovering old ground and basically expecting the uh, community to have already watched the previous stuff. So, so there's that. But anyway, so that's number one. Just, just to set expectations, I'm still excited for the series. I'm still looking forward to it, just like I was for OVA4 and OVA5. But then as a more hardcore fan, someone who has a bit more knowledge than your you know, average person who just saw GXP or Tenshi Mio on Toonami, or maybe, I, mean, I don't think it came on Adult Swim. I think it was just Toonami. But um, if that's your only experience with Tenchi, yeah, you're not going to... It's going to be a high bar, I think. <clears throat> it's not going to be like a direct sequel to the GXP anime that you see running in the background. It's going to be um, quite different based on the GXP novels. Now, the, now, that brings me to item number two that I wanted to discuss. And that is the, um, <clears throat> I made a claim that I knew that Kajishima Sensei was not happy with NB, the Nabashin, whose uh, NB care we uh, see on the screen there, right there, on the left. That is supposition on my part. Someone said that, you know, there's no, there's no proof of that, and that is correct. Officially, Kajishima Sensei and Nabashin did pressers after, uh, to promote GXP when it came out. And both of them said, hey, everything was hunky-dory. Everything was lovely. Blah, blah, blah. And to me, that's always just been, well, what, 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 what do you expect? What are they going to say? Oh, no, we had problems? Of course not. They're not going to say that. But <clears throat> there is nothing out there where Kajishima Sensei, for example, says, by the way, I couldn't stand what Nabashin did. All we have are basically circumstantial evidences, like number one being in episode 17 of GXP that Tajishima Sensei took over the directorship. So that suggests to me that he was not happy with what uh, Nabashin had been doing in terms of story changes. And so. Kajishima Sensei was taking over episode 17 to make sure Nabashin didn't change anything and to make sure that GXP and OVA3 were set correctly. So that was like number one. Number two, in the episode 17, Kajishima Sensei put the NB character, which is Nabashin, into the literal doghouse. I mean, literally, he's in the doghouse the whole episode. So... <laughs> to me, that's a symbolic gesture on the part of uh, Kajishima Sensei that, yeah, you, you're out of here. You're in the doghouse. 
Um, <laughs> I don't really like some of the, the things that you've done. So that's another thing. And then uh, I mentioned earlier that Kajishima Sensei never covers the same ground twice, and that's true. GXP is the only exception to that rule. In, G in the GXP novels, he actually retells the story of the GXP anime, but there are some differences. Now, it is, as people will point out, to expand the world of the, uh, his universe of Tenchi and all that stuff and to continue telling the GXP story. That is all true. <clears throat> At the same time, like, for example, the NB character is completely different. It is not even the same character in the GXP novels as it is in the uh, anime series. So that's number one. It's, uh, in the anime, NB is Nabashin. In the novels, it is the astral body of a character called K-I-R-C-H-E. I can't remember which character that is. I'd have to go look it up, but K-I-R... C-H-E. I'm, I'm doing this video on the fly, so I apologize for not being better prepared. But that aside, um, that's a huge difference. And NB's role is reduced in the novels. So to me, that says, hey, if, if, he, if, he, if Kajishima liked what Nabashin did, he wouldn't have changed it. And, and the big thing you have to understand about Kajishima, and when he writes stuff, there's a purpose. Um, if you don't know the deep lore, I mean, this stuff is like almost like deep, like Tolkien is for the Hobbit and Lord of the Ring, uh, universe. It is deep, 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 deep lore. Um, all of his franchises are, are all kind of tied together. So, and if you've watched GXP, you know, at the end, the mecha unit from the anime series Duel uh, shows up, and there's a reason for that. It's because Duel is actually set, you know, billions of years before Tenchi Mio, the first OVA series, in terms of the timeline. Um, and so it is the actual original uh, Zenv uh, from <clears throat> Duel. And then the uh, other uh, things, you know, Kajishima has like uh, like the Photon series is is actually set on Geminar or Geminar. I can't remember how you pronounce it. Stuff like that. <clears throat> but anyway. So I'm rambling. But anyway, if Kajishima Sensei had been, you know, totally pleased, he wouldn't have felt the need to uh, redo the novels. And I think, honestly, that if uh, in the his original GXP treatment, he probably had the NB character um, as... Uh, this uh, Kirsch or Kirche or whatever, however, you, I've never heard it pronounced, so I apologize. I don't know how to pronounce the character's name, but um, okay, so I took a real quick second to look up. There's uh, the Kirsch character, she was initially NB, and then her astral form went out of NB and took over a uh, one of the Fuku clones from the GXP anime that you saw. And then her astral form, she's actually from Duel, and it's Mickey from uh, from Duel. So now, uh, now you know where she came from. But that aside, um, Kajishima likes to set these things up well in advance, and so in my mind, you know, he probably already had this all planned because he already had the Duel connection from the start and he probably had it, you know, he probably would have had uh Kir uh Kirsch be the uh uh NB and uh or at least the AI, not NB specifically. NB was created specifically for Nabashin, but an AI uh would have been done for Kirsch and you know the Kirsch element was completely uh expunged from the uh GXP anime. So but that aside there is no proof is, is what I'm getting at. And I want to acknowledge that publicly since in the video, the last video I said, I knew for a fact that Kajishima Sensei and Nabashin didn't get along or something like that, whatever I said. That's not true. I do not know specifically. I don't know Jack. All I know is that the, um, 
the the circumstances are such that it looks like they didn't get along. But as I was reminded also by another by uh, a, a Japanese fam, uh, Kajishima Sensei and Nabishing did do one of the recent uh, GXP audio commentaries in Japan. So if there were any issues, this guy told me that they put them aside. But uh, there's no official proof that they had any issues at all. So I just wanted to publicly acknowledge that since I made a public video. And uh, yes, uh, it is just conjecture that they didn't get along, but there is circumstantial evidence that points in that direction. So that's it. So, but I'm still looking forward to the Jigs anime, even though it's going to have a high entry bar. But I'm curious to hear your thoughts about this additional information. Let me know in the comments below. Like, subscribe, and all the other stuff. And we'll see you in the next video. Talk to you later.